Hello everyone, it's your favourite queen, Android18 here, and welcome to a new reaction video. Okay, I'm going to preface this video and let you guys know I'm reacting to something that's quite long. It's from my friend Big Jack Films, and I meant to react to it ages ago. Um, it's his 100th episode, and it's his review of Dragon Ball Evolution. So we're in for a treat, and I believe there's two parts. Or no, three parts, actually. So they're all pretty long, but I'm going to start by reacting to the first one. By the way, I've made a new channel recently called Kame Droid, and it's a Dragon Ball discussion channel. So if you're interested in more Dragon Ball content, and you want me to specifically talk about a topic in Dragon Ball, please follow the link in the description below, and find my new channel and subscribe and comment down below what you want me to cover there and I also want to thank Jack because he's actually made me an intro for my new channel and he also made the intro for this channel that I use so please give Jack some love go over to his channel subscribe to him hit the bell you know subscribe to him and like his videos I'll leave a link to this video in the description so follow this link to get to Jack and um yeah I'm not gonna rant for too long because um this video is like 34 minutes, so my computer's going to enjoy editing this. <laughs> but anyway, let's get into this amazing reaction video, shall we? The following is a fan film based video review. Oh, cool. He's doing a credit Dragon thing. Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GT, Dragon Ball nice. Super, and Dragon Ball Evolution are all owned by Funimation. Dragon Ball Evolution is such a trip. TV, Shueisha, Fox, Sony it's kind of crazy. Please support the official release. I've actually been looking forward to this. I've just been super busy, so. But I'm finally doing it, Jack. It's it's reaction time. Well, oh, Mr. Satan celebrating his nice Mr. Satan to hold this special tournament. His victory. It is a tournament after all, so we couldn't. This is pretty cool. Like a um, <coughs> voices and stuff. <laughs> Piccolo's like a sign. My only weakness. I think this is gonna be really good. Oh. Oh, it's Jack, I think. Maybe. Piccolo's gonna be all wigged out like he was with the Supreme Kai. This is really cool. It's like an episode of Dragon Ball. All right, last call hey, it was me. Just smacking the um pad to show our power. Um, excuse me, sir. Do you have a name? Because you didn't fill out a form. Alejandro. I go by no name here. Oh no, missed. Skull Boy. Put me under Anonymous. Farewell then, Anonymous. Go right up ahead to the punch. Anonymous, what a great name. I could have thought of that myself. Smack it. He's warming up. Oh no. Oh, he destroyed it. <laughs> he must be pretty strong. The editing in this is really good, I'm really liking it. Just put me under the strongest components. Uh, of course. <laughs> Interesting. I think there's gonna be a huge fight in this by the looks of it. All the crowd's just like, what the heck is going on? <laughs> Pretty much. Goku's just like, I'm hungry. And I'm just kind of stood there like, what are you looking at? The atmosphere. I recognize that falcon of music. Hey, Big Jack Films does such good editing on his videos. His intro is so cool. If you like King Kong and Godzilla, Jack also covers a lot of um, King Kong and Godzilla. So if you like that, go subscribe to him. He's done loads of good content. His editing's better than mine. He puts so much effort into his videos. <laughs> that shark though. I love your intro, Jack. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, comment in the... If you're in the premiere, comment like what you like about this video. Also comment in the regular comments. Like, Jack has a whole team that work on his videos with him, but a lot of the work is basically Jack. Like, Jack gets guests in. However, Jack pretty much edits it all himself. Hey, it's 18! Alternate version. Hey, it's James Rolfe. 
the angry video game nerd. That's very cool the way they met. This music has a lot of swag, I'll admit. This is basically like a TV show, it's awesome. Oh no. Hey guys, what's up? It's Big Check Films here, and welcome to another review. He's contemplating reviewing Dragon Ball Evolution. It. It's slowly it. destroying his mind. It's like a song enough, but we finally <laughs> We are celebrating the 100th episode! Hallelujah! Yay! <laughs> pretty sweet. I like that song by the way. That's one of Krillin's training songs. He loves a good bit of sweet victory. It's hard to believe how long it took to get to this point. As a matter of fact, it's not yeah. just 100 episodes we're celebrating this year, but it's also the 10th anniversary of me actually doing movie reviews. That's crazy. Okay, those might be 10 oh, years old, but it's still that's an old video. <laughs> Ten years on YouTube. That's amazing, Jack. anniversary of one of my all-time favorite anime, simply known as Dragon Ball. Yay! I want Jack to destroy Dragon Ball Evolution, though. Tian. back in the mid '90s and took the world by storm. The premise is kind of complicated. It's the story of a superman character. Jack always explains things in such good detail. Adventures with his vast amount of friends while also battling in an alien god and legendary war over the mystical seven. Pretty much, yeah. When once gathered, will summon the powerful dragon Shenron that can grant one. He also for androids. I gotta drink this video because it's long. To make it almost 600 episodes and counting. Not to mention 22 movies. Oh yeah. Thousands, Melissa. Thousands. I was first introduced to the anime thanks to Sailor Moon on YTV. And while that show is deserving Sailor Moon is cool. It does deserve mention as my introduction to anime. The first Usagi is so cute. Actually, was the original Dragon Ball series, most notably during the arcs with Emperor Pilaf. It didn't leave much. Pilaf was a bit of a creep. Was a passing time waiting for Beast Wars to start, but it wasn't. Yeah. Moved to Milwaukee, Wisconsin, that anime became more of a hobby and pastime thanks to cartoon. Oh, Piccolo Pilaf. looked really mad in that shot. Sure, That's in so Garlic Junior when he attacked us went, like for the second time. Yu Yu Hakusho and Tenshi Muyo. It wasn't until the Ginyu Saga dubbed by Funimation started catching my interest, and when the entire Frieza Saga aired, I was hooked. Tuning in Frieza is a crazy the little alien, alien boy. Continuous battles with the tyrannical Frieza. Hell, when the Frieza Saga aired, it had Frieza Sama. That year, beating out the top television program of that time, Survivor. Yes. Yeah, so you Dragon Ball's dimension is the best. I don't know what this is. television, but sadly not seeing the finale until buying the VHS, which by the way, big oof. It's kind of a sad letdown if you missed it. Johnny Bravo talks about Dragon Ball. Okay, that's a dream come true. Yeah, your editing's amazing, Jack, by the way. That's pretty hardcore. Hey, 18 toy. I sell all the merchandise. That is pretty sick. Wanted to be him. And as a Son man of Goku. Detail, I even remembering buying several orange and blue t shirts and pants and creating a vast amount of costumes he wore all the way down to the back. That is pretty cute, costumes. not gonna lie. That was basically my first learning curve in the continuity of costume design. That's quite sweet. It was an important way of setting the emotional scene for a movie. The costume departments made sure that the smallest detail is never overlooked. As a kid, the highlight this is so in depth, I really enjoy it actually. And for me, Loving any style of hand. Hey, combat, it's when I beat Vegeta up. The tapes over and over to get down the moves in each strike. The fight with Frieza ultimately became my physical workout every day. And as time went on, I tuned in every That's kind of crazy. Aired, That's dedication and love for you. Saga. But until I had to move back to Canada and watch the ocean dub. Why should I? Super Saiyan 3. Majin Buu's eating everyone we care about. The ocean dub's really cool actually. <sighs> Although it's censored, the voices are great. Confusing 
losing at the time. Goku's Kaioken in the but World's Strongest is actually the best the in the Ocean dub. Back to Dragon Ball was, of course, the characters. The waifus. That was my guess. Accomplishments was the characters. From the main heroes yeah. to the iconic villains and even the side We are all pretty cool. All Especially Mike Krillin. He's really awesome. He's so cool. Oh, Gohan looks mad there. You also want to root for them to succeed and make it out of the dangers Oh, Bojack was a douche. Goku, of course, but there was also Gohan, Krillin, Tien, Trunks, Bulma, Master Yeah, Rai, more Krillin Rai, spotlight. Rai, I want to see it. Even the villain, <laughs> Buu, That's funny. Some of the most iconic villains in anime. Hell, Frieza is the anime Majin Buu is a piece of work. Actually, seeing those two in a conversation would be fucking awesome. To be fair, Frieza would probably just kill the Joker because the Joker would make him look silly. This editing, though. Abridged Frieza, though. <laughs> Jeez. It would be interesting. Oh, jeez. I love Mark Hamill as a Joker. He's awesome. <laughs> Freezer just like finds it interesting. <laughs> That's good, amazing. Mad Big Green again. Oh, here we go. This is where the curse section of the video comes out. That's a pretty cool fan film, though. Yeah, live action doesn't work, though, in my opinion, for Dragon Ball. It seemed like the perfect series to make money for Hollywood. Although Dwayne The Rock Johnson would be great as Nappa. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, they didn't care when they made a movie about us. A live action movie, I mean. I watch it, I watch Dragon Ball Evolution very occasionally, but I don't watch it as a Dragon Ball movie. I ignore it's a thing in Dragon Ball. Because the fact it's part of our universe is, um, I just, I can't take it. Ah, there it is. I know that my inner beam just now. Here we go. <laughs> Oh jeez. The, the fly scene though. I agree. Oh yeah, Alita was really good. I, I like that one. Although, um, I can't think of his name off the top of my head. The guy who played Roshi wasn't that bad. It's just the script was terrible. Yes. No, Yamcha. Don't worry, he's my favorite baseball player. Drink time. Is there anything that's redeemable about it? I pray to God. A couple of things, probably. Considering it's the 100th episode and the 10th anniversary. I don't remember his name either, but um, the actor who played Piccolo in Evolution wasn't the worst. He fit the character quite well. Let's see if there's any redeeming qualities to this film, or if they it's just the script completely ruins the whole thing. Dragon Ball Evolution. I feel bad for Toriyama because he wanted to be involved in Evolution's creation, and um, the movie company pretty much told him to go away. So that's so disrespectful. Oh jeez. <laughs> Okay, that's pretty nightmare fuel. Oh, I recognize this dude when I watch Jack's other videos. I'll protect you, Jack. Don't worry. It's Nappa. Well, Nappa is a movie producer and a bridge, so... Oof. 
Regular Piccolo. Regular so Big Green. Oh jeez. I'm getting PTSD flashbacks just seeing this footage. Ozaru. Ozaru, yeah. Are you freaking serious? We're not even a minute Oh, Jack's just blowing his mind. <laughs> yeah, they didn't even read the manga when they the people who made evolution. Exactly. Probably not. Oh wow. <laughs> Oh no. Hey, it's I just noticed that's an Android 18 Lego minifigure. People love me in different dimensions. Jack has an alternate version of me, so that's pretty cool. In his world. Oh, jeez. Which allows you to harness your energy to create a massive blast and wipe out Oh, every please no. Phrase. I mean, come on guys, as kids, we all tried to unleash our key with Gohan. I can imagine. I'll do it slowly. <laughs> anyway, you can Jack's like taking notes. The first thing you have to do is I'd watch Gohan. <laughs> He's like making a novel about it, <laughs> trying to learn. Was this gonna be on the test? Whoa! Just bring it out. <laughs> it's as easy as that, guys. Just bring it out. I don't think this is gonna go very well. <laughs> The build-up's just great. Oh no, he forced it. It's either going to do nothing or it's going to just explode. <laughs> He's trying so hard. <laughs> Gohan's like, dude. No. You're overthinking it. Mechanical Sapor. Jack does have some pretty impressive power, though. Watch his videos to find out. Wow, his channeling is in a Palpatine. I think Jack's losing his mind. He's trying to channel every energy in the whole universe of everything. <laughs> Oof, big oof. You've got to relax your muscles. You're never gonna bring it out if you're all tensed up like that. Exactly. Well, if you'll excuse me, Gohan, I'm going to take a five minute break to get the proper accommodations. Oh dear. <laughs> I was not expecting that. That's not the way to do it. Oh jeez. <laughs> jeez. Good message. Don't don't do it. You guys know the deal. Never eat yellow snow. Same criteria. Oh jeez. Michael Bay written teenager is more concerned with being normal and wanting to fit in. So Gohan gives him a This is where my Dragon Ball Evolution impressions come in. Teach me how to be stones. normal. Oh, it's one of the seven mystical Dragon Balls that if Sorry, I'm, I I I remember too much of this movie. Well, okay, that's one thing they actually managed to get right from the original source material. Yeah, Goku watched Dragon Ball Evolution. He got bored halfway through and then went to go eat. And then he saw the fight at the end, and then he basically just said, um, did Mr. Satan direct the, uh, movie? And then he instant transmissioned away to go eat a Chi Chi's. So, yeah. That's what Goku thinks of Dragon Ball Evolution. 
I think Jack's world is coming apart because of the movie. Yep. <laughs> Damn, bro. Oh no. He burst through the bit where um the guy says Giko. <laughs> oh, little boy Goku. Little peanut. I really love the detail of Jack's videos, though. It's really, really cool. Please, um, go subscribe to Jack if you're enjoying this. Don't forget, please. Also, like this video if you enjoy it, because it helps the channel. Oh, that's the Geeko guy. This is so bad. <laughs> Pretty much. The sound effects, though. Superman is pretty awesome. Oh, I love Tobey Maguire. He's the best Spider-Man, in my opinion. Hey, just because you cry it doesn't make you weak. It actually makes you quite strong in most scenarios. He just hit Goku in the deck. Low blow Vegeta. I didn't see that fight. Visually, Justin Chatwin actually looks like the part of a live action Hollywood version of Son Goku. He kind of has the hair. Hear me out. Now I know what you're thinking. There's also a funny scene where his hair comes out of the way it should look. Remember, guys, Goku isn't human. He's an alien. And in that sense, it's open to interpretation. Even when early promotion on the film kind of, yeah. and looking at him in the classic gi, I saw a live action Goku. So I will get yeah. he does, he just kind of look the part. He looks the part. But if written better, could have been a damn good Goku. And yeah, just the chat one's not a bad actor. He's trying to give a good performance. Yeah. Beauty. I agree. This is the bit I was talking about. <laughs> that is quite funny. Because Saiyan's hair always normally bounces back to its normal shape. Oh, it's more of the um, martial arts tournament. Get him, Goku. Oh, it's the edgy dude. Anonymous. Edgy boy. Hey, it's Chi Chi and Bulma. It's me. Vegeta's just looking mad as usual. No, he knocked out Krillin and Big Green. He should have used his Makonko Sapo. Well, Goku should be able to sort him out. Not at all. It's pretty, pretty legit. I didn't participate. I can imagine I was too busy. Self-proclaimed. Oh, it's okay then. This editing's really good. He'd be like, come at me. Just fight already, as Bridge Tristan would say, but he'd say the F word instead. A bridge twistin' from Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged. Get him, Goku! I'm rooting for Son Goku. Obviously. Nice! But is 
Anonymous gonna power up. Does this satisfy you, my friend? This is what's known as a Super Saiyan. You won't find anything stronger than this. The voice acting is cool. I like it. I'm still trying to tap into it. Not to mention it's hard for the planet to handle it. Then you better not disappoint. Let's do this! Oh, is it actually going to be a fight? Oh, this is pretty cool. Oh, jeez. I'm not sure what Goku this is, but... This may be a weaker Goku than I actually know. He looks similar, but he's not the same. This is really good editing. Goku's got some tricks up his sleeve. Oh, Roshi's to iron him up. You still fight like a young man. With nothing held back. No reserves. Admirable. But mistaken. You are true. Go on, Goku, get up. One of the best I've ever faced. Did he just one shot Goku? But my friend, it's kind of crazy. You will have to stand down. Or I will have to break you. Hopefully the best oh. opponent. Bane. Gratefully accepted. We will need Vegeta would have something to say about that. No. I won't. Come on, Goku. You can do it. Such a shame. I was wondering what would break fast. Get him, Goku. This is pretty legit, I like it. Your spirit? Oh, he can teleport. Oh jeez. Yeah, it looks like this fight's over. Oh, Vegeta's like, no senpai, he was, I was defeated. Oh jeez. Yeah, he fell out the ring, so he lost. Well, Goku didn't do very good. It's kind of surprising. Hey, it's me. Oh, there's some sort of connection there. Goku is out cold. Jeez. Aside from the Spider-Man characteristics, on top of that, this movie's got all the basic high school movie tropes, including <laughs> bullies, boring classes, and Goku wanting to hang out with the hottest chick in the class. Oh no! Here we go. And honestly, I'm not gonna. She's a very pretty lady, though. Wide over a female character from this franchise. One of the biggest moments for me in Dragon Ball Z was when Dr. Jiro battles the Z Fighters, especially when Goku suffers from uh, the Oh, is a piece of work. Vegeta's future son, Trunks. As the fighters chase Jiro into his lair, it turns out he... Bad memories for me, apart from me and Krillin. Oh, no. important that he has to keep in that tank. It's me! It was me, Austin! It was me all along! <laughs> oh, that's music from the ma the mask. Hey! <laughs> okay, I think Jack likes me. And that was the day when a boy <laughs> became a man. Oh no. Stay down, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> the cybernetic organism that grasped my heart after Sailor Moon ran its course. When she first appeared on the screen, I was hooked on this character. And not just the fact that I'm she surprised Jack didn't like Bulma. But the fact that she was an elegant and wild style character. A person who was free spirited with no boundaries and any that didn't meant a kick that would break an arm. Pretty much. I remember that very vividly. 
first, and I just loved her for that. Even I hurt Vegeta right in the pride. Piccolo and Vegeta were, she eventually redeemed herself and became one of the best characters in the series. I didn't do anything wrong, really, did I? I was made that way. How we ended up meeting in the first place. <laughs> I think Jack needs to recover from that pretty painful situation. Okay, Mr. Satan's got to win the tournament. He's the champ after all. Like, he even beat me. Come on. This is an interesting matchup. These contestants are the best of the best. The strongest fighters in the universe. Oh, it's me. Okay. Mr. Satan must have not participated. I wonder how this is going to go. This alternate version of me seems about my strength at that time. Are you just gonna stand there, or are we gonna fight? Cause I won't hold back after what you did. <laughs> yep. I'm surprised. Sounds like me. Your programming is far greater for which of less I know. I know who you are, Lazuli. Uh, you know my oh. name? I know all things. I know that you are not- This is not expected. Lazuli, for I knew her since I was a boy. Oh. Well then, you should know I was reprogrammed at some point. So it's hard to tell if I remember anything of you. But it doesn't matter. I'm, I'm still, still gonna, gonna make you pay. beat you up. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, he took his cloak off. This editing's really good, though. It's pretty sick. Who are you? You will find out soon enough. You weren't the Jack, uh, were fighting Goku. Why are you holding back now? What do you want? Pretty much. I thought he was holding back. Look at me go. eighteen has got a good voice actress in this. Hey, like me a bit of key blasting. This editing's really good, though. Yeah, let me guys know what you think of this video. I'm really enjoying it. Oh, I see leaving. Wow. Anonymous fell out of the ring. Contestant number 18 is the Looks finger. like I win. Hey. Although he did quit. What the hell? It's not a satisfying win. Uh oh. That sounds so, like future trunks ish to me. Oh, for part two, two maybe. Hmm. Later, ma'am. Okay, that was later, ma'am. He suddenly became nice out of nowhere. Android 18 is victorious once again, but at the cost Yay. of his friends. The real question remains. As a British you, you would say, Yay! I won! As his target. The answers and more oh. will be revealed next time on Big Jack Films Reviews. That's pretty cool. Hey that was guys, a cool back. On part two of the Big Jack Films Reviews 100th episode, part two. I have my work cut out for me reviewing this piece of Shenron shit. But that's not <laughs> The story continues with Android 18 out for round two. It it's pretty cool. It's like a show within a review. It's actually awesome like that. Or will it? There's a part three. There's more secrets to be had. Okay. So, this is basically Jack's um, outro. For the other parts, I probably will skip the intro and outro. 
Well, that's cool. But I'll keep the credits this time, unless the credits change. Jack's put so much effort into this video. I spoke to Jack as he was making this, and he spent months on this review. So, please go over to Jack's channel and support him. Follow the link in the description to this video. And, yeah, Jack makes videos all the time, so check him out. Also subscribe and hit the bell for both my channel and Jack's channel so you never miss an upload from us. But Android 18's in pretty much all of Jack's other videos so if you like Dragon Ball he's got you covered. Also there's two more awesome parts to this. Oh. Okay what I'll do is I will skip Jack's outro because it's pretty much just music and like telling him about his social medias but um if you subscribe to Jack you'll find that anyway but uh yeah that was really really good I really enjoyed it I won't keep this video going much longer because it's already long but if you got this far thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed my reaction to Jack's video yeah thank you so much I hope you have a lovely day and comment in the comment section down below other things you want me to react to and yeah I love you guys and also don't forget everyone subscribe to me because I'm definitely 18